Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is basically gonna be my intro, and I'm gonna put it in black and white so you guys won't know what hair color I have. I filmed how I got rid of my bluish hair, and it turned out what I did, how I mixed it, how lazy I am, how long I've been dyeing my hair. I will try to fix it as much as I can with the color correction because in my bathroom I do have yellow light which I have to change it, but I have it. Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, let me just put this a little bit down. All right now, so we're gonna go ahead and remove this color already. We're done with it. And we're gonna go ahead and go. I am currently listening to Neza, which I, which I absolutely freaking love. This is like my new jam, literally. So I literally have less than an hour to do this. We're going to do this in a rush. So I'm just going to prep the stuff for my hair and comb it. So it's just temporary. So we're going to go ahead and add our beautiful bleach for it. I am going to be doing a mixture. Oh, I love this one. But this is my favorite developer. It's Brilliant Bond, and I use the developer 25 just to activate it, okay? Conditioner. This is from Aos. I really got a big one because, I mean, girl, girl needs it. Oh, no. Okay, so now what we're going to do is we're going to comb our hair. The reason why we have gloves is because sometimes the bleach does irritate your fingernails and can cause, like, first-degree burns or even minor than that. But just so you guys could have your hands, you know, safe. So, make sure you're always wearing an old t-shirt or a t-shirt that you don't mind getting bleach on because it happens. Half of the times it does happen. So, I'm just combing through my hair. Okay. Ya que estamos así, ya nos peinamos. We already combed our hair. Now, we're just going to go ahead and split our hair so we could get the bottom first and then the top. So, we're going to say bye-bye to the blue. Look at this horrible transition. Ugh. All right, grabbing some and just applying it. You can either be very careful and just do sections. I honestly, like, I've been doing this since the longest, so I just go ahead. Like, I have no fear. But if you're new, you're barely doing this, do step-by-step. -step. Section off your hair, small sections, and then go for it. I just go for it nowadays. Okay, so now we're going to let this set for about half an hour to 45 minutes. I'm going to put a bag over it, and I'll see you guys in a bit. My camera literally just fell, and I broke my heart. <laughs> so I totally forgot to film this, but this is how my hair ended up being after the 45 minutes of light bleach. Hold up. So right now, I'm just touching up my roots. Where the dark part, I'm going to do the darkest red. Because as you can see, not a lot of it came out. There's still a lot of blue there. Some more than other places, which is horrible.
using this one. I still have like this much left. guys and this is the end of my video and this is the color that it ended up being it's not one it's it's not the color i wanted okay i was expecting it to be like very very bright pink but look how dark and rich and i don't know like it came out so freaking different than what i was expecting definitely it did even out the color i used one completely I do have a lot of hair, but I did mix it in with um, Arctic Fox, the Wrath one. I did end up mixing up, but then I ran out, right? So then I only did the Arctic Fox down here, which kind of looks a little bit less purpley than up here. But I mean, you can't really tell a difference that I used a different dye in the bottom of my hair. Just that it's a little bit... Let's see if I can get some out. Ugh, not you bam so you can't really tell the difference i did do it in the bottom only so we are good i did my nails from kiss and i ended up i was like you know what i have so many nails that i just leave there because i don't have any more so i'm like i'm gonna mix it up like i don't think so you could tell but i'm gonna show you guys not perfect like i did it really quickly because i wanted to film this video and i had no nails so this is it so i have them from two sets these two are from the same sets ah and then these are from the same one. So I have a glossy nude. Then we have a rhinestone one, which is beautiful. We have a holographic one. And then we just have like a matte pink. So they look really cute. They don't really look like they're from different sets. So that's a good thing. And um, yeah, this is how my hair ended up being. It's like really, I don't know, like it's different. Like it's. I don't know, like, I feel like it has, like, different tones onto it, which is, like, so cute. I haven't been dark in a really, 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 really long time, so it's kind of, like, new to new to me in general to even work with dark hair color. What do you guys think? I do feel that I look a little bit more darker, which is okay with me. It doesn't really bug me. I love looking either tan or pale. It doesn't really bug me. I love my skin tone. I'm very proud of it. So today is Friday. So this video would be uploaded on Saturday. And you guys will be the first people to see me with this hair color. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you guys want to shop my boutique, it's just down below. It's Latina Lux Collection, which is, you know, um, just a little, little, little sneak from where I got the name from. Basically, it was going to be um three latinas working together so i was like you know what let's make it easy let's make it known because hey you know we're hispanics it all went to like wait 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 and i kept the name because i really did like it because i'm a latina and i'm proud of i'm proud of everything that i've done so far and um yeah that's where the name came up and lux is short for luxury and um your girl's working on her bot tie so i can start taking pictures and i just don't want to feel self-conscious anymore i want to be able to love my body the way i am like from blue to this color which kind of makes me feel like mermaid vibes but like the evil mermaid video and i'll see you guys in my next one